the concept of what you mean by concurrent lines. Now, when you talk about concurrent lines means, suppose you have a point here and two lines could easily pass. But suppose more than two lines pass through them, then we call them as concurrent lines. What, where do we apply, say for example, you have a triangle and you have this median of median which is passing through the midpoint of one side and the opposite side and this is suppose x1 y1 and this point is x2 y2 and this point is called the x3 y3 so this is one median the other median is this say this and the third median would be joining this and this it will be observed that this third median also passes through the same point of intersection so we have three segments or three lines intersecting at a single point then we call that these lines are concurrent lines so in any triangle the medians are concurrent that means all the three medians pass through a single point or they intersect at a single point and this single point is called the centroid it's called the centroid and in terms of coordinates the centroids coordinates are x1 plus x2 plus x3 upon 3 and y1 plus y2 plus y3 upon 3 in short just as the midpoint of any segment is the average of the x coordinates and y coordinates of the end point same way the centroid of any triangle is the ab is the average of the three x coordinates and the average of the three y coordinates so this is just to tell that centroid is a point of concurrence of all the three medium similarly if you have any triangle like this you will have altitudes three perpendicular to the three sides from the opposite vertex and the third altitude will also pass through the same point so we say the altitudes of a triangle are also concurrent and we call this as the orthocenter orthocenter similarly if you have a triangle the three angle bisectors will also concurrent angle bisectors are this 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 they will also pass through a single point and this is called the in center so like that whenever more than two lines three or more lines pass through a single point we call them as concurrent lines so this is what we understand by <coughs> concurrent lines we'll definitely find out sums which are based on this concept 